Oh, uh, Landkeeper, let me guess, you're crawling back here for revenge after you brought down your whole operation, huh? Uh, Eugene, I think there's something wrong with her. I think she's, uh, broken. Well, uh, I, I think you might be right. So we have a hostile reception. Why don't you take a seat and we can get to know each other? Don't tell me the Landkeeper is joining the band of misfits. So are you feeling okay? Can you t uh, yeah, I love Viola. Viola interacts with people in quite a hilarious way. I was saying before, Casey and Viola had some amazing dialogue together. So are you feeling okay? Kaylee, sorry, not Casey. Uh, can you tell us about yourself? Prophets, down. The Landkeepers were minions of an Archangel we defeated. Maybe when their boss fled, all their brains got fried. I still don't trust her. No job, prospects. Welcome to the club. Welcome to the club. She doesn't exactly have a sunny disposition, does she? <laughs> sunny? Why don't we call her Sunny? We have to call her something. Have we just adopted a zombie? Landkeep is bankrupt. Nothing left. Why? Still here. Maybe the landkeepers only exist to carry out their jobs, and now that she doesn't know what to do, she's like a machine without a purpose. Oh, you poor thing. There's still plenty of time for you to make a fresh start. I wanted to taste this local drink called coffee and the delicious is known as cinnamon rolls. Drinks coffee, they taste for energy. <laughs> I must need more. Me in 2020 when I tried coffee for the first time. Now, <laughs> I often, after like a week of caffeine, I need to take another week off so that I don't get headaches without it. <laughs> Maybe the first step is getting you some new clothes, Sonny. I'm sure wearing that outfit off us all day is pretty miserable. And then it's great, let's meet up Harbour Town's tail. It's on the upper level of Harbour Town, just north of here. I guess we're going clothes shopping with Sunny. Let's take a quick break and heal up. And talk to our dog. <laughs> it's such a funny visual, just Barkley sitting there. Ah, oh, maybe that's what the DLC is, you know? Catacombs, that's where zombies live. And they do sound like they're building up Sunny as a character. I want to try some of these baddies. Um... <laughs> Maybe it's happening. Maybe I'll dump Spitzfire as much as I like Spitzfire. Um, Spitzfire. Oh, but you are like nearly level 5. I'll stick with these guys for now until they get to level 5 and then I'll change out my team a little bit. Okay Felix, are you okay with poly relationships? With who? Sunny, definitely. <laughs> oh Sunny. Okay Meredith, welcome to the club. Yep, um, and we're going to just check out the, <laughs> the little boutique first for Sunny, apparently. I do not know what's going to happen to her, but is this it? No, that's her history place. No, that's a bootleg place. Someone needs to put a sign up, I say, and there probably like already is a sign or something. Chemist store? It must be this place. No, this is where Felix lives, isn't it? Yeah. Did I go to the... Let's, let's check the quest list. I must have gone to the wrong part of the town. How does it feel? Yeah, I'm on the wrong side of the town, my god. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I got there eventually. <laughs> Can I um take a shortcut by playing Katamari? Oh, yes, yes. This must be it. Nope. 
Um, this must be it. No. Oh, I forgot about you. You're like the astral type person. Yeah, okay, I know how astral types work now. Must be here. Here we go. Oh, hey, everyone's here. I'm still not sure we should be helping her out. Are you forgetting the time her former employee tried to take over the island? I did get the free bootleg. Mine was a... I'll double check. It was... I haven't used it. But yeah. This could be interesting. Well, I think it's a fire type. But I can't remember what it was. That's sunny. I'll take you back here and you can pick out some new outfits. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> what? What is this? Sunny? Yeah, I'm not too sure about this either, Kaylee. I'm having a great time already. I'm not sure about this one, Sunny. Get back here. Oh! Maybe. I'm not sure. Maybe. That's not the direction I was expecting you to go. You don't look super comfortable in that, Sunny. How about we try another? Let Meredith dress her. Meredith has the best sense of fashion. Oh, wow. I think I look good. <laughs> I know you got to stick up for the little guys, for employees, a little guys as well, you know. It's for higher ups, which of assholes. Kaylee, is it just me? Is Sunny? Oh my god, Eugene's now attracted to Sunny. What the hell? <laughs> Make capitalism sexy, and Eugene flips sides all of a second. Absolutely gorgeous. No, that's not just you. Okay, it turns out Sunny is actually cool. Who knew? You look cool, Sunny. Okay, this is me now. Thanks for the help, all of you. I have some very mixed emotions. <laughs> Eugene! You're such a blubbering idiot, I swear to God. <laughs> We're glad to be able to help you, Sunny. Harbour Town lets everyone have a fresh start. It's only fair that includes zombie estate agents. Landkeepers are not zombies. Landkeepers are vessels created to work. Not anymore. From now on, I'll try to be Sunny instead. What the hell? Help Sunny start a new life. I'm losing it, man. Hey, Sunny. Hey. <laughs> okay. Um. Quest log. Let's do a captain or something. Let's do Lodestein. I feel like he's not going to be too powerful. A friend of mine said a thing about the quest. This game is impossible. Make an real estate attractive. <laughs> yeah. And then they fucking own it as well. They're like, yeah, I bet you love our sexy real estate agents. Oh, nearly lost my stamina there. This is a risky way to traverse the lands. But I'm never gonna have to surf again. I get the feeling there's a cave down there. Oh no, just a tape, but I hadn't got it yet, so good thing I checked. Okay. And then I'm going to want to climb up around here. Activate this shortcut, even though I don't really need it. And jump down here somewhere? Let's climb. You look like- oh, what the fuck! Oh, instead of having to do that annoying puzzle, I can just roll up here now. Thank god. Yes, no, maybe. Maybe if I go here first, and then I go, here we go. I'll be with you in a second, bud. I've just got some final repairs to make. Right, all done. Levy Lodestein. I work with the Rangers to keep the lights on. You want to know a secret? We harness electricity for this town's power grid with these pylons, but we really have no idea how they work. My, edu my educated guess is that there's a unique kind of background electricity here in New Rural that these pylons can conduct and store. But these wouldn't work on Earth at all, no chance. Earth's atmosphere doesn't work that way. Enough science talk. You're here to take advantage of my Ranger Captain. My Ranger Captain challenge, am I correct? 
No, what is it? You're talking, are you talking about the Puppet Master one in the mall? Oh, that one. Oh, I might have not done that one yet then. I haven't done the Archangel in the graveyard. Oh, <laughs> so you, I guess that makes sense, right? But I, for some reason, I always kind of interpreted Eugene to be like an 80s kid because he looks like he'd be in some like retro zombie movie with like a baseball bat smacking shit up. But he's actually just a youngin. That is quite funny. Okay, I've got the cat here. I think I've like activated the graveyard one, but I haven't done it yet. But that might be after I do a couple... I think, what does Barclay's gravestone say? Surely they can't kill a dog. Like I know they're not killing a dog, but writing a gravestone for a dog just feels wrong. Uh, no, let's not give you multi-target. Oh. <laughs> That is kind of funny. Mm. Let's give broadcast and then we'll see what we can do. I mean, maybe this is going to be a useless use of broadcast, but... Ah, I've been conducted. Everyone's conducted. <laughs> what the hell is going on there? And I'm out of AP to do anything useful, which kind of sucks. Okay. Oh, is it like the Konami code or something? Okay, I'll keep that in mind when I get in there. <laughs> I don't know the Konami code off by heart, but we'll see. Okay, um... I guess just battery. I mean, I could swap out to something that actually does something against this guy, but we'll just stay with our strongens. <laughs> Thank you for the reminder. <laughs> yes, I forgot the up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. <laughs> um, just Roman Dam because he's powerful. Let's raise some arms. And just double smack you. That's a code that wakes us up in my morning. <laughs> what? <laughs> what does that mean? Or do you have like an alarm on your phone and like to turn it off you need to enter the Konami code? Shocking. Shocking, you're performing better than I thought you would. Yeah, thanks mate. Oh, we could fuse. I don't think it's necessary, but we could. Yeah, I mean, let's just keep on double smacking. Shocking. <laughs> Please hit. Oh, fucking hell, of course he missed. Maybe I need to just be rid of suction cup dart. <laughs> Amped up. You're really feeling the voltage. The power. You're feeling those electrons flowing through your coffee. <laughs> Even though that makes no sense. I hope there's no electrons flowing in your coffee. Those electrons should not be flowing. Okay, suction cup dart again, even though it will be overkill. I just want to land that damn hit. Or we might not even find out, because he's dead. Shocking. What a shame. Shocking. He actually said shocking. <laughs> that was a pretty electrifying fight, if I say so myself. Forgive me for the puns, it's a force of habit. Here you go, here's your reward. There we go, we're ticking off. The ticks. I prefer those gym electric highlight prints. <laughs> true, true. He should say that. That should be one of his voice lines. Oh! Ah, oh, I really crowded that up, huh? Okay, open this. 
Vine ball up. Oop. Jump. Vine ball. I need to... Yeah. And then I need to just watch my shadow here. I think if I just drop here, we should be good. Yeah. Okay. Um... And then I think we had another captain. Ooh. Rolling up the hills sometimes feels like pushing out a, a dump. There's just like some unpushable resistance being met with me. A nice hidden chest. Earth resistance, okay. Oh, there's that creepy ice lady. Oh, that's a... That's totally a captain. I think he's gonna use our kid or something, right? Um. But I kind of want to he heal, no? Yeah. <laughs> That's my beautiful intuition. That's campfire. Oh. His strategy is unique. Oh, that's worrying to hear. I wonder if we were able to find our way back home, our real homes. Would all this time have passed here? Or do we end up back at the moment we left? Like all this had happened in the blink of an eye. Yeah, and honestly the sad thing is, if we do go home, we all come from different places and different worlds. So it's bye-bye Meredith, bye-bye Sunny. We'd have to give up the new life we made to go back to our old one. And yeah, and what if the time has passed? Some people have been here for like... Decades, if not more. Okay, let's challenge you. Captain Cody. They call me Cody because I used to code. Well, I used to break code. Anything in the information space can be cracked if you're smart enough. Websites, video games, government servers. Captain Skip as an example. What's wrong with Captain Skip? I got in trouble. Oh, true! <laughs> yeah, where is he going? Or is everybody just going to leave without him and him and like the other first generation island will person will be um, here and be like, okay, I guess it's just the two of us now. I got in a little trouble for that last one, but here on you were up, there's no internet. What a joke. The only thing here for me to hack are these monster tapes. It turns out I'm pretty good at that, which is why I'm a Captain Ranger. Come on, I bet you're desperate to see my modded cassette tapes. Modded cassette tapes. You're not going to mod my cassette tapes, are you? You're playing, with power. You're playing with power. Oh, I like Apoco... Apocrolips. That's such a cool one. Okay, let's fuse. Become an absolute beast. Go for... Elemental Wall. Is his strat just to make me whatever type he wants? Make it, oh wait, what? Yeah, okay, we're fine. Fusing wasn't a good idea. What's gonna happen? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Let's go for Brick Blast. Silicon Slash. Oh, I've been made glass type. Is he gonna... Well, I haven't been made glass type, my wall has. But I'm guessing that means he can like resonate me or something, right? I don't know glass type well, but... I'm guessing it's not good for me. Okay, they missed. Which is good for me. Please make me air type. <laughs> Wait, no, I lost my glitter. I can't be made air type. Okay, keep the brick blast up. Okay, I'm being made air type. Okay, no, that does apply resonance. That's bad. Yep. Tacoma bridge time, baby. <laughs> Ooh. What happens if I unfuse? Only one of them will have resonance, right? 
Oh, see you later, <laughs> Mary Jeff. <laughs> Sorry about that, champ. Let's see if we can get rid of this crow. Well, that's the third resonance. Bye-bye. That did not do that much damage. Why does a crow lips have so much defense? Oh god. They've just finished off Meredith. Well. <laughs> Ooh, I'm in a predicament. I mean, I'm not air type, so I don't think a crow lips can do that much damage anymore. I think Cody's has slightly less defense. Oh no, never mind, they still have Glitter Bomb. Hmm. No, they go first. They missed. Okay, I've got a glass wall now. We're gonna nurse. That's my wall gone, right? Not quite. Deja vu, moldy strike, okay. My glitter coating wears off in one turn, so let's wall again. Never mind. I've been made glass type. Fuck. In fact, and I could have really used that glitter bomb actually hitting me. I think we just take the loss on our deer here and hope that I can swap into someone else who can do something. Yeah, that was a really pretty color palette, right? Okay, so air type. I think plus mantle is my stronger electric type. I don't have anything that attacks all targets, right? Okay. Oh, you're kidding me. That gives me uni target. So I'm going to just miss every hit now. <laughs> oh, no, do not do this to me, man. And now I'm glass. And I'm still missing every attack. Okay, Shining Kaneko. Would Copper Chop have been good? Did I fuck up there? Okay, I'm not glitted. I'm now glitted. <laughs> I've rolled again into Elemental Wall. I suppose that's actually good. Oh, so I could have resonated them. My wall is now glass. I missed this damn uni target. Holy shit. Okay, roll again, smack. That's good. Now you're sparkly. I could make you sparkly too. Bye bye to my wall. We're all glitter now. The glitter's got in everywhere. It's in our pants, it's everywhere. We're all part of the glitter brigade. Now I'm glass. Okay, Cody's down. It's just the bloody crow now. Sadly, I've been glittered up. I'm now part of the Glitter Brigade. It's 
Seems like glass anything is just really pretty. <laughs> I don't know, what's what's good here? I just gotta hope I can do enough damage I think. Yeah, one more hit. And I'm not glass type, so they can't resonate me. Yeah, yeah. So many of the like and I mean that's something so cool about how they do shinies in this game. Also, I can't believe we won that fight. We won just barely, but we somehow won. Like, the way they do shinies with them being bootlegs and actual different types is so cool. And then, like, yeah. What? How did I lose? I mean, I intended to lose. This was just a test for you after all. And you passed. Congratulations or whatever. Only three more. Oh, he was the last one. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Don't get any ideas that you won on purpose, you hear. I was, if I was going all out, you wouldn't stand a chance. Okay, keep telling yourself that, Cody. Yeah, the order sometimes feels pretty arbitrary. Wait until, oh, who's her? What do I have to look forward to? What's that? Purple cloud, come back here. Spark Tan. Okay, I've got like no HP. But let's see this. We're gonna make it water type. Maybe that would help. Because then we have electric type. I don't think we're actually winning this fight because <laughs> level 47. These are my last two monsters. We can try. Yeah, that was the problem of making it water type. No. Let's go for Inflame on Spark Tan. I'd like to catch a Spark Tan, but it just seems like it's going to be pretty tough. See you later, Meredith, sadly. Idiot. Idiot. Um, huh. This is going to be very hard to catch. Because it's one on one now. But I can damn well try. I missed. <laughs> well, I'm not trying hard enough, apparently. There we go. Okay. It's like no HP. Go for the record. No, but if we record, Tom's going to take damage. <laughs> I love Cleo, though. Yeah, I mean, this is just a super gamble. Hopefully it uses like evasion up or something. It didn't. Please miss. It did not miss. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, look. I think I've just died so many times that I do not care about my resources anymore. So I've just, you know, willing to gamble a little bit. <laughs> Let's go to the graveyard because that's a thing that we haven't tried properly. Okay, Meredith, let's go hunting. What an unfortunate end for you. A dead end, you might say. I'm surprised they didn't go with um, the Majora's Mask line with... What was it like you seem to have met an unfortunate end? I can't remember what it is. <laughs> Here lies Tomix, died in the year AD, age unknown, rest in peace. 1967, I guess that's a concrete, concrete year for when Meredith was around. Should have stayed in bed that morning. Oh, Meredith, you hear that? Shouldn't have woken up. 
Show me how much you wish to survive. Fight for your very lives. Okay. Let's beat this shit up. Level 42 Gelaton. Hopefully we do alright. Is that gonna poison me? No! You don't have that poison contact passive or whatever. And more scaly jelly in case you want to get more pumpkins. I'm using I wish to see more. So I want to see... I know you told me the code, but I might just try a... Wait, what? <laughs> he just took away my gift. He was like, here, have a gift. And he was like, actually, no. You'll rest a different day. Fight. What the hell? Alright, let's see if we can catch the pawn dead. I mean, swimmingly so far. Yeah, I keep on donating AP. It's not going to help you when your buddy's dead. Buried six feet under, you might say. Oh, you're dead too. I did mean to catch you, I'm being honest. <laughs> I didn't think I'd one hit you. I can't record a called for help guy, can I? No. If Robin's reached five stars. I think you learn Sonic Boom is probably decent. That's um because there are definitely some moves on Spitfire that are not <laughs> really helping you out. Like I never use Zoomies. I'm sure Zoomies has its use, but I, I never use it. You got a good Sonic Boom, let's equip that. A wrong turn down here will send you to your grave. So I'm back here. Okay. So I guess it is just Konami code. Which is scrolling up. <laughs> up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. Look at that jumps. Left, right, oh? Ah, oh, okay, so if you take too many turns, it will give you a hint. Oh, I must have screwed it up. Really? Up, up. It did say down, down, didn't it? <laughs> Up, up, down, down. I swear I did down, down. Oh, I, I obviously did not do down, down because I went left here for some reason. Left. Right. Left. Right. Oh, is it maybe counting? I'm so confused. Up. Down, down, left, right. Have I messed up my cardinal directions? What am I doing wrong? Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. What the heck? <laughs> okay, so if I'm just gonna follow the idea that I get a new room until I make a mistake. So what happens if I go... Well, I fucked up. Where, where have I... Oh, down, as in fall down the pit, maybe, is what it means. Oh my god, there'll be a demand for land to bury in... Oh my god. There's still land keepers about. I thought we got rid of your kind. Evidently not. Okay, let's take out the gelatin first. 
I thought we were freed of these nerds. Oh my god, poison ball. Beast wall. Oh, you're just keeping the walls coming. Let's beat up the king then. We can worry about the jelly dude later. I love Galactic Beatdown. Like, it always hits, which is good, and then it's also just straight up a good move. <laughs> oh, Vengeful Curse, why don't you fuck off? One day I want to get Summon Tolpa to work, because I'm really curious what will happen. But not today, it seems. <laughs> I'm being mega poisoned, oh my god. One more shooting star. One more summon topo. Ah, uh, oh, well, thank you for your bullshit gelatin, but you're now gone. Silicon Slash. Yeah, I mean, I think we can get rid of Zoomies for that. Add some diversity to the types you have. Maybe we should quit being a land keep and become a grave keep instead. So that was down, down, so now left. Oh, so we need a ticket. Right. Left. He took my ticket! <laughs> he took it! The damn bastard! Yeah, I get another chance at trying to catch these guys. Alright, uh, see you later, Robin. It's been good knowing you. Kineko, you're up. Go for Galactic Beatdown, which I think will one hit it essentially, and so just a, a chrome tape should be good. Recording. Recording! Probably could have gotten away with a normal tape, honestly. Didn't need to use one of my chrome domes. Still at 100% chance. <laughs> See you later. Cool. cool indeed. Pawn dead spend much of their time in a dormant state, transmuting their bodies into durable granite. These pawn dead statues can alarm unwitting travelers passing by. Find themselves unexpectedly in company of expressionless skull faced monsters. Yeah, I'd be pretty alarmed if I randomly found this monster too. Dun 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 dun. And then right, I believe. No? What if I repeat the directions until I get to that door? Down. Left. Put in the ticket. Wait, did I not pick up the ticket? Apparently I did not. <laughs> Oh true, he like teleported it away. Left, right. Left, right. So I do need to beat you, I guess. Because maybe you guys hold the ticket. Be nice if we can get Sonic Boom going. Oh, you would. Okay, you poison mold him. That's alright. I <laughs> see a jealous on. Grounded is a pain, but we will make do.
Yeah, missed. Galactic bait down should be an easy one hit. Ta-da. And there's our ticket. The clock strikes midnight, you humans all face death eventually, so do not keep me waiting. Okay, well, we have the train ticket. But, can I heal up first? No, I can't. I need to find my way out. Up, up, down, down. And then now when I go left, I have access to the exit. Okay, um, party, map, sorry. Ooh, Ema. What are you two talking about? So you quit your job because your bosses kept screwing you around? Pretty much. It's more than that, though. If I went to work somewhere else, I'd just have another boss giving me orders. The only way to break the cycle is to work for myself. No more bosses. Yeah, that's the spirit. No more bosses. Live on your own terms, man. But my career plans have hit a roadblock recently. I think it happened after I fell through time and space and ended up living on a monster island. It happens to the best of us. That's cute. I'm still waiting for the Barclay conversation, so they must exist, right? They must, they must. Hey. Oh. The Gramophone Cafe always reminds me of Dad. He'd brew a pot of coffee every morning before heading into London for work. You're a Londoner! A London, in it. So that coffee is smell, it casts me in my vein, ain't it? Sounds nostalgic, ain't it? I get so. I can never tell I'm my, 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 I can't talk in an English accent. I'm so bad at it. <laughs> you have never had a huge amount in common. They grew up in a different time and different place. I guess there was a big generation divide. It's not my fault my parents listened to incredibly bad music. When I moved out to go to college, we didn't really stay in touch. That's okay. That sounds kind of lonely, but sad. I suppose it is. You know, I don't have many strong memories growing up. I have friends and life experiences, but thinking back on those memories, it always feels like there's something happening just around me, not something I was participating in. Like I never truly, like I've never truly been in the part seat. I guess I was an uncle kid, then as an uncle teenager. As for being an adult, well, there's still time to see how I'm doing at it. I think you're a pretty cool adult. Yeah. No one ever tells you growing up that making friends as an adult is hard. At least we're friends. It's easy with us. We have like a hobby together. A hobby? Yeah, we're looking for a magic world portal. That's hobby. Right? <laughs> okay. I mean, I hope we'd still hang out even if we didn't find your doorway. Of course we would. Cool. Hmm, I'm more tired than I thought. Do you think transforming on and battling counts as exercise? I guess it is pretty exhausting. Anyway, let's go hang out together and punch monsters and stuff. You tell them, Meredith. You tell them. You tell them. But for now, we've got a, a problem on our hands, Meredith. There's some dude who wants to deal with us. Oh, another captain location. Okay. Any room is here, we'll just check here for any dialogue that might happen, since we beat a new captain or two. If I knew that people would be calling me Cody Fair, I would have picked a cooler nickname like Killswitch or Omega by God, you're edgy. I mean, you can just pick your own name, I did. Wait, your name wasn't always the Amph? Nope, my, in my former line of work, it was safe to pick an alias, I'm sure you can relate. The Amph is the name of the water goddess in Greek mythology, I needed to choose a name and a pitch and I thought it sounded good. You sure do have a lot of secrets, don't you? Don't expect me to tell you any more than that. So is she a part of, like, the FBI or something? Wow. Okay, map. Back to graveyard person, bro. Hopefully we can do this fight. It might be tough, but we'll give it up a shot. A weird feeling again. It sucks. Let's try and move through it. Let's go, Meredith. What monstrous design is going to be here? Oh my god, what the hell? Oh, an archangel, we're in trouble again, aren't we? That's a bit of an understatement. What the hell am I looking at? You meet things, dream of death so much, you spend your entire short life dreaming of it. Is that what brings you to me? This guy looks pretty metal. I get the impression he might want to kill, so... Let me feast in your fear as I show you a true death. Yeah, he does look pretty metal. Lamento Mori. 
Dreams of death. What the hell? Well, I think it's time to fuse, and um, let's hope we can get something going here. I can I lower your accuracy because that would be good. Status blocked. Guess not. You've used a beast wall. Okay. Um, slightly annoying. Galactic beatdown is not going to break your wall, is it? Um, best thing I can do is oh, rapid fire actually will break your wall completely. Right? Yeah. Bone cannon. Maybe I should put a wall up myself. Mm, I'll wait till they're up to like. Yeah. I'll just galactic beat down for now. Ritual. Doesn't that mean you come back to life when I kill you? It does. Oh. Oh, you monster. Okay, let's elemental war now. Walls intact. They've got a wall going too. But they're using their ultimate. So I guess I rapid fire to break their wall to the best of my abilities. It would also be good just to have one of the moves that I know, Death Ray, that's terrifying. I know there's moves in this game that just straight up bypass walls, and that'd be quite good to have. Let's go raise arms and see if we can suction cup dart or something. Ah, oh, that's gonna heal you, isn't it? Oh, only a very slim amount. Okay, that move means nothing. Suction cup dart. Please hit. It does hit. Suction cup dart again. Okay, now they ritual onto 25% health. Return fire, I love to see it. Suction cup dart again for knockout if we land the hit. Which we do! Lamento Memorial is probably one of the easier Archangels we've faced in a while. Oh, can never can get shine and beat down. That's probably better than Wink. I never use Wink. That wasn't too bad. That's what, six parts of a song now? If you wish to leave this land, then yeah, yeah, I've, I've, I know this part, lady. A river that flows through this land, its source is where you must now be. Harness lightning where you stand, the path will open up to thee. Oh, I haven't played Amori. I've heard that Amori is good, but I haven't played it. Is Wolf Tycho's not streaming right now, is he? I don't remember him streaming Amori. I must have missed that, huh? No, not right now. Not even our kind can escape true death. No, oh, I'm not in wonder, I think. Oh, we need a big skeleton guy. Every team needs one of those. <laughs> it's a very um, dry way to put it. Do you even understand this place, human? Do you even feel these tunnels braving? <laughs> the number of nightmare creatures that want to kill us on the island is just way too high. I agree, it is way too high. That elf gets around, doesn't he? It seems like he can stand anywhere as long as he's within the underground railway station. Amori is... Like, from what I understand, a depressing game about relationships. <laughs> Apparently the story and characters are very good, but um, it does touch quite sensitive material. I haven't played it, but I've heard, like, exceptionally good things about it. Do you have another lead you're following up on? Harness lightning where you stand, the path will open up to be. If it sounds like you have to do a thing at a certain place, I guess you better get back to adventuring. Yeah, yeah, I've been hearing lots of things, but how many, so I've got six out of eight song parts, there's nine in total. I know there's one at the shipwreck. 
Oh, well, I know we're like two of the last captains now. Let's go for Captain Heather. Did that count as rest? It did not. No, it did. It did? It did. Okay. Let's get a move on. Don't know how long I'm going to stream this game today, but I'm making good progress, eh? I'm not planning to beat it today, that'd be too much of a rush. But maybe... Maybe I'll end up beating it tomorrow. If I stream it in the evening again. Oh, there's a rogue fusion there. Let's just try to think, where do I want to go? Let, let's use our fast travel. And we can go here and explore these oceans a little bit. Just got to get out of this creepy abandoned ship first. Okay, so maybe somewhere over here I saw like a landmass. Oh my god, I'm being chased. I guess I don't have you, so let's try to catch you then. Good, okay, and then I think we do... I can't Galactic Beat down yet. Let's just repeat that then, and then I'll be on like no HP. Okay, um, record, honestly let's just basic tape it off. And Brick Blast. Maybe we should have gone Galactic Beatdown instead. It's alright. Oh, Brick Blast is going to make catching it a pain. Maybe I should have gone for Chrome Tape. <laughs> 24% chance, yeah. Okay, let's try that again, but go for Galactic Beatdown and we'll use we'll use a chrome tape. I don't have like a recycled tape, do I? Nah. I need to buy more chrome tapes in case I meet one of those legendary monsters again. Thank god it missed a hypnotize. 100% chance. Love to see it. Cool. cool. Welcome to the club, Weevil Life. Okay, um, but I am looking for a captain. Ah, you look like a captain. Let me up here. Yeah. Mm, my party's somewhat on low HP, but let's just send it and try our best. This is Heather with the weather. <laughs> what? Today's forecast unpredictable as always. Humidity fluctuating, chance of precipitation, who knows? But well, maybe you're just like myself, a climate of new morale is an unending puzzle. You're arranging your training, correct? If you think you can brave the storm, then why not take my range challenge? Okay, Captain Heather, let's go. I guess... no, I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> um, I guess we're gonna target the side one first. I've never seen the... this Ouroboros... Ouroboros monster before. Ah, they've... made things hard for me. Okay, go for Galactic Beatdown. This might take a second attempt. You just snowed yourself in. I guess you used ranged attacks, it doesn't matter. So I guess every turn she's gonna snow shit in, which is annoying. So 
So I should go with my ranged attack. So let's go for um, charge, then battery. Oh shit, is charge ranged attack? I've been given multi-target, which is good. Charge is ranged attack, that's amazing. I'm going to be able to get a battery double wombo combo as well. Really nice, okay. Gotta have to stick to bone cannon just because I need to play ranged. Battery's melee! I can't get away with it. Thunder Blast is ranged, so we can do that. So the Spooky Honor just every turn snows us in. In that case, maybe I should be targeting the Snake instead, because the Ice Lady is not attacking us at all. Well, I mean, I guess with the attacks I am using right now, I am actually targeting the snake. It does just mean I need to do that every turn. Okay, and we'll Thunder Blast every turn. And I keep on Magnus in his Zephyr, which is quite good. Multi-target for days, even when a little electric ram faints. Oh, please, you're kidding me. You're so close to looking out. A tire tube? No way. I think it's supposed to be an, like, Ouroboros, a snake that eats its own tail. Maybe it's just a bit hard to see in the dark, but I don't, I don't think it's a tire tube. <laughs> as funny as that would be. Okay, snake down. And ice lady might go down this turn too. Yeah. Good shit. Bone cannon heaver. The winds are shifting in my favor, you best believe it. A grass boy, huh? I don't know what to say to that. Um, just Thunder Blast, it'll do an air attack, which will be quite good. Because we get AP Drain, uprooted. Spit, that's the best we can manage? Oh, you're countering my multi-target, but I don't need my multi-target anymore when there's only one of you. Oh, a beautiful damage that I can now do, now that I can actually use melee attacks. Well, have you, silly Billy? Seems you've met your match. Sorry, love. No, rain or storm could hold you back, huh? You stand tall no matter what. Those are qualities we look for in rangers. You've passed my challenge of flying colors. I've got two more, eight and eleven. I forecast great things in your future. Thank you, Heather. I like that forecast. <laughs> What's down here? Anything I should be interested in? Got a little dock here, although it seems mostly empty. That down here. Ooh, I see a chest and a button and a lever. Lots to oh my god. Well. <laughs> ah, I see. I need to carry the rock over here. Drop it on the switch. Fly over. Open the chest. Master puzzle solver. Yours truly. Okay. Um, and there's a bit more of this map to check out, huh? Do I have that Sands of Time guy? I have not. He's literally called Sands of Time. <laughs> um, let's see if we can catch him, eh? Gotta deal with annoying jellies first. 
Oh, that was easy. <laughs> what the hell? I've been poisoned, but that's all right. Okay, Meredith, since you're grounded, what do you say to trying to catch this thing while I give it a galactic beatdown? A beatdown of galactic proportions. Boom. Up to 100%, of course. And just use contact damage, okay. <laughs> Sorry, Santa time. You did not put up much of a fight. The core of Santa time appears to be their broken hourglass heads. Any sand separated from their central mass will become entirely inanimate. Conversely, the Santa time can grow in mass by making contact with sand. So you put you in a desert and you're just going to be colossal sized, is what I'm hearing. Okay. Seems like you can level up beasts after their max level just for random moves to be unlocked. That's totally trapped, we're not opening that. <laughs> Why are there so many zombie landkeeper looking people around here? I thought we were free of the zombies. Or maybe not zombies. Let's camp here and heal because I think we've got a captain nearby. Have you noticed how Harbour Town provides for everybody, no matter what they bring to the community? I mean, the locals still have their own problems, sure, but no one is cast out. Everybody kind of contributes what they can, including Sunny, the literal zombie. And if you can't, no worries, mate. It's kind of a lonely society, sure, but it's not a cruel cool one. I can't, uh, I can't exactly say where, what I, for what, for where I, you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> okay, let's get a move on, Meredith. Let's see if we can find these captains. Some zombie people. Got a switch. Have I activated that switch before? I don't believe so, because I couldn't jump that high before. Ta-da! Nod tree bark tape, okay. So this is a graveyard that I was hanging out in. Did I miss anything interesting here? I did the small puzzle to open up a big gate. You're a literal ghost. I'm not talking to you. Okay, let's just go south then. Oh, we're going off the map. Okay, we are going to drown. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. Oh, we can go so high. Anyway. Oh, wait, that pawn dead was real. What do you say we beat it up just for some XP? Because I feel myself getting a bit behind the level curve, which is not nice. There we go. Oh. Are you not a trainer that wants to fight me? Oh, you are a trainer, but you're a ghost boy. So I need to, um... You're a ghost forever. I don't have the... I don't have the anti-ghost moves. I don't believe so. I'll see if Galactic Beatdown hits. But I don't think it does. Because I don't think it stops it from being evaded. Being ghostly doesn't stop you from being evaded. Um, isn't evasion. If not, I'll run away and quickly put a sticker. Yeah, okay. You must be a little side questing then. Because you're a little puzzled to solve, aren't you? Okay, party. Ramtasm, check tape, edit stickers. We're going to, um, we're just going to take sheer luck and replace it with whatever lets me hit ghosts. I know one of these can do it. I 
Here we go, phase shift. Okay, let's talk to you. And now, you should be able to attack ghosts, but our Meredith won't be, but <laughs> it's alright. Oh, I hope it's alright. You still have a lot of HP. Hmm. Can't do anything to help. Not really. Most of like two galactic beatdowns, hopefully. I need to heal you somehow. So that fixes a tape. I just want to heal a tape, but I guess I can use it after you die or whatever. Having the AP drain on you really sucks. Oh, this fight is still going to be annoying. I thought we were going to be fine. So, Kaneko, can you do anything? I guess this elemental wall, and you use the respawn, our only one, on Ramtasm. Bring it back up. Yeah, that's not going to help. Um, Elemental Wall, you... No, I clicked flee! Fuck, I'm an... I'm an idiot. That's alright. Let's try this again. Maybe this is worth fusing for. Just to have those boosted stats and whatnot. Now oh, you have that boosted. Yeah. So again, Galactic beat down every turn and we'll want to... Oh, see, that's beautiful. Yeah, this is just an easy way to do it. Hopefully there's not a captain around the corner that I needed to fuse to beat. Oh, that's the first ghost I've actually defeated, huh? Okay, there we go. Whoops. Oh, there's a room of a ghost around here, and I thought it was you. You just disappeared? That was it? <laughs> really? I thought there would be a... Maybe we can find him again later? I thought there would be a better payoff for that quest. Um, edit stickers. Phase shift. Replace sticker. E1 for one that lets us dodge shit. Which is... what was it called? Sheerlock, that's it. Because I think Sheerlock's really good. Okay. So we've got just a crab chilling on this island. What about here? Yeah, there's a captain. Okay. We should go back and heal though before we do this. We are filling up the map. We've literally nearly finished, filled it up completely now. My gosh, we're getting through this game at a pace. I think once I beat this captain, I will end the stream there. Because that will have been decent progress.
Um, can I fast travel to you? Yeah, I can. Zoom in around. Ooh. I love the like infinite flight thing. That feels so good. Definitely worth it catching that crazy bird. Mm -hmm. Captain Gladola. You're a long way from your home now, aren't you? I don't mean Harbour Town, of course, I mean your true home. I'm Gladola. I'm a loyal captain of the Armface Rangers. Loyal. Much of this purgatory that we find ourselves trapped in is unknown to us. In this world, the shadows have claws. My job is to scratch them back. Okay. Tell me. Are you here for my range captain challenge? You're welcome to try and face my blades if you can think you can handle it. Let's try. Is she going to be the tough one that we were warned about? Okay. Right off the bat, I'm thinking we have, um... Hmm. Oh, let, let's just see. Let's just see. Let's get smacking and see what we can do. Okay, I see. So they're making me berserk. Is that going to be the whole gimmick here? Which means we are probably just going to have to raw power through it. But that's okay, I'm going to go for that to lower your accuracy. What do you say to a double slice? Yeah, yeah, that's good. Oh, that was a lot of multi smacking. Okay, accuracy down, I like it. Bish bash bosh. I need to lower your accuracy. I'm not happy that you managed to hit that. Um, battering ram, you out of PP. Dodge evasion up. Okay, good thing we have um galactic beatdown, so your evasion will not matter if we survive. I guess if both of you have low accuracy, though. The sheep naturally has. Good accuracy. Jagged edge. Fuck off. Galactic beat down. Peekaboo. Accuracy down. Okay, I see what we're doing here. They're making it really hard to hit them. Okay, we landed that hit at least. Galactic beat down. Smack's probably not going to hit. Oh, I mean, Kuneko is probably not even making it out of his turn anyway. Tomix is on one sliver of an HP. Um, let's get you in, see if we can, like, the evasion is a pain. But if we can land some big blast or something, I don't know. I mean, their accuracy of oh, Jagged Edge killed me. I was going to say, their accuracy on the sheet must be so low because he's on low health, but... Doesn't matter if they get something like Jagged Edge triggering. Okay, Southpaw is down, thank god. 2v1 now. Hopefully we can make this a bit easier. Just need to <laughs> manage to hit it. Yeah. And there's another monster after this, I should keep in mind. I if I can get Inflame going. That'll be good for um, just slowly burning away the HP regardless. Yeah, Inflame will kill them even if it misses, which it does. No, not yet, okay. Soon, soon! <laughs> <clears throat> So slow their stats, slow their evasion. Just give him a smack, save some AP. Oh, it's gonna deal numbers. So now we get to see the second monster. He missed. Yeah, missed. So who's who you got? 
Gladiola, never seen you before. <coughs> ah, is making them water type a good idea? <clears throat> I don't really have much of a choice otherwise. Let's glitter bomb them. Double slice. Well, I'm not going to get to glitter bomb them, am I? Do I still have those electric dudes? Hope we have to apply conductivity. I do. I don't know if we... I don't know if we get a guaranteed hit on critical hits. But we can try. I'm surprised I managed to hit. <laughs> I don't know how we're landing these hits. I guess I'm just getting very lucky. Or something. See if we can get battery to work now. I think if we get battery to hit, it's probably a knockout. Especially with the burn and conductivity going on. Yeah, I missed. Jagged Edge makes missing a pain. Literally. I guess if I can just wait out the conductivity and the electricity should be good. I mean, the conduct frame would burn, but... There we go, Gladiola down. Ooh la la, see you later, nerd. Nicely done. Impressive. I didn't think you had it in you, but you're sharper than you look. Your victory is well earned. So that's number 8, so where's number 11? We got jagged edges. Some I was viewing my mission, I was sworn to secrecy of the nature of my investigations. Of course, don't take it personally. Okay, well, let's return to the cafe. We'll look for any last minute rumors and then close off the stream. As fun as it has been, all good things must come to an end. Okay. Captain Sybil. In the marshes somewhere, apparently I've missed her. How many am I at? 68, I'm very close to 70. And can I do anything from you? Yes, let's get a fusion meter mod. Sounds good. Okie dokie, let's heal up. And stream. Next time we'll try to take on the last captain that we- Oh yes, finally a Barkley! Who's a good boy? You are, yes you are! Arf, arf. <laughs> See, I knew it'd be cute. Um, next time I'll try to take on the last captain. And then I guess we'll just um have the... Whatchamacallit? The last Archangels to do. I believe. Yeah, we've got one rumor, literally, and that's the last captain. I know where one of the Archangels is. There should still be two other ones. So hopefully I can get some rumors about that. But this has been Cassette Beast, a lovely game. I always love playing this game. Sadly, it has come to its end, as we can tell by looking at the map. But I get the feeling that the finale is going to be damn good. But yeah, we'll finish it off here. Thank you for everybody who tagged along. It's been good fun. And um, I'll see you guys whenever I stream next. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.